All right, ladies and gentlemen, we find ourselves on Brax's holdout. The friendly team today, Kel'Thuzad, Greymane, Lucio, Stitches, and Ragnaros. The enemy team, Lili, Garrosh, Leoric, Varian, Rin, and Azebo. I don't know what High King's Quest means. It's probably Twin Blades, right? I think Shield, usually, shield and Smash usually take the, the Q-Town at level one. We'll see if we're right. That's triple frontline for the enemy team. So it does give me a lot of targets to shoot at, but also a lot of enemies I have to run away from constantly. We'll see if we like it. We're gonna take barb chains, chains deal more damage and reduce armor of anyone that we chain, allowing us to potentially shred these tanks a little bit easier. Uh, they're not letting me land too much of anything, are they? There's a root. No, yeah, it's just a slope. Caught inside of a zombie wall the entire time, too. I'm at zero stacks so far. That's not a great thing. Whoop! Goodbye. You know, I feel like Lucio was closer to him than me. I feel like Lucio was trying to take that, and the game should have let him. That's five members of the enemy team down here not doing fuck all, though, while our Ragnaros is getting that tower down up top. If they continue this game, we will easily pull ahead. They're literally not soaking half of the map. You love to see it. We have returned! The first chain connects! So does the second! Uh, I'm just gonna root. Just because I thought it would land. We have chains again right now. Nope, 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 nope. I hate you. <laughs> All right, will they continue to push the bottom lane as five or will someone leave right now? Let's find out. We're getting on the objective pretty fast. Looks like Nazebo might be the one to get out of here. I love that. It gives me even more front line to shoot my spells at. We'll just keep clearing the lane. Nazebo has arrived up top. We see Leoric on point. Very good route. Greymane's here for damage too, so we are actually stacked in the bottom lane. Good route. I have my spike, so we're halfway done with our quest. That was pretty fast. With that start, I wasn't feeling very good, but that's a very good quest completion. We're gonna take Phylactery. Hopefully get a little bit of life steal in this match as well. Uh, the enemy team has mostly fallen back, which either means they're all rotating top now or they're getting a camper. Something. Yeah, it looks like a five man rotation to the top lane. Look at that. Well, I'll just stay here. That's no skin off my back. I'll keep soaking. That's not fair that you can call him reinforcements. So that was a 1v1. You should have respected it. Vultures. Enemy team really doesn't have a lot of lane clear either. So they are going to have trouble dealing with this objective. I can't say I'm a fan of their strategy. I don't think they thought it out very well. Since he's dead, I'll go ahead and gather this region globe too. That brings me up to four. Ragnaros coming to take the bottom lane. Honestly, I could leave, but I think we just both push this. Uh, we already have a really good push up top by the looks of things, getting that tier one tower down on the first objective. I think uh, me, me and Rag, we just keep going. They don't seem to be able to stop them. Stitch is constantly pulling people back into the minion wave up there as well. This should be the tier one wall at least defeated. If nothing else, we still have half of the objective health almost though. I think I saw someone potentially roaming for us. I'm gonna take a quick step back. We don't see half of the enemy team. Uh, and they're, okay, there they are. <laughs> All right. All right. Thank you, Kronk. I got it. Ooh. Looks like an 11 minute win. Yeah, if they keep playing like that. Uh, chill touch just makes it easier for us to land our combo. We're at 10 region globes right now too, so we are almost done. Everyone missing from top lane, that's my cue to leave. 
we'll just go up to our team now. Well, very good start. We're halfway done with our quest. Exactly halfway done. Uh, it's a two-man rotation down. That was a Twin Blades. We called that as well. Honestly, I think Smash would have been better for their team comp. Garrosh throws someone, tries to make him vulnerable, tries to make him isolated. Like that, like that. Hi, team. You, are you, are you glad you threw your healer in? <laughs> I got through it. <laughs> Hold on, we could chain, we could chain. Oh! Horrible. Well, I'm going to keep pushing. No reason not to. Friendly team is soaking top lane right now as well. Things are looking great. Phylactery is done. I feel like that might be my fastest phylactery completion ever. Thought that was going to connect. Unfortunately, the tower did better than I did. Region globe available beneath me. We'll go ahead and grab that as well. Gray made a little low on mana. Three members of the enemy team down in the bottom lane. We don't know where the other two scurried off to. I don't imagine they are very far. No, they are not. We have Spike again. Good combo. I'm just going to throw my CC into that. We'll chain forward as well. Stitch is thrown into the belly of the beast. I think that's their entire strategy. They're just trying to throw isolate us. <gasps> my spikes have not been good. Usually I rely on my spikes. Well, while they are five-man deathballing down in the bottom lane, Ragnaros is soaking everything up top. The objective just became available as we see Leoric trying to sneak by. Uh, Garrosh being here is a little scary. Tried to chain to Nazebo, didn't work out. We might be able to slow these guys enough, though. Lots of hits coming from the tower onto Varian. Close. Thank you. Thank you for the boop. Uh, they have sent the lone Lily up to the top lane. <laughs> oh, we should move in. I guess is what I'm saying. Go, go in. <laughs> they have their healer up top. I'm missing point blank chains. That feels terrible. But here we go. Here we go. The best ability in the game. Wait, did Garrosh just beat my chain? Did Garrosh just beat my chain? He threw right as I, right as I chained. Good death and decay. Whoa, I didn't think that was gonna work. Whoa. Beautiful. Well, I'm out of mana, boys. Good luck to you. Just finished my quest with that as well. As the lava wave takes bottom, we now have a two level lead. Solo lane Lily still up in the top lane trying to get some XP. Friendly team, meanwhile, going for the enemy's mercenary camps. They were ahead on the objective to their credit. Ultimate ready again, so I'm ready to fight as soon as we get into the next confrontation. Looks like Nazebo Lili moving for top, very enforced to solo bottom. Can I solo him, you think? Eh, maybe. With my healing, I might be able to do it. Either way, he backed up for the time being. Hold on. Oh no! Oh god, okay. We're healing. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. And that's why you take the level four quest. Oh god, that's a big spirit. Can we chain him? No, I don't think we can. That was good. Oh god. Uh, huge minion wave here. I don't think these guys are going to be able to defend against this. I'm going to get chain cooldown and send it out. Varian is slowed as he tries to run away. Uh, I'm just going to ult them. No! 
That's fine. I think he creepy walked my CC away. Potentially. Thank you for the boost. Got him. That's Lily dead. All right. I'd like my uh, public service announcement to be don't death ball in a game that's all about soaking XP. And this is why. We're gonna be like those dare commercials for the 90s. This is why you don't death ball. Who said it was gonna be an 11 minute game? Cause you were wrong. wrong. It was a 10 minute game. <laughs> MVP. I would love to say I think that game knocked off the rust and my like health is odd, but I don't think it did. Every skill shot that I sent out was just me praying that it would connect. Don't death ball, kids. Don't do it. It's bad. <laughs>